All right, so Kana better be center or I'm going to riot. Hey guys, what's good? How are we doing? Welcome back to the channel. All right, so on our last reaction to Oshinoko, it was almost fully focused on the Bikomachi group. We didn't get a whole lot of Aqua. We did get the one scene of him going out for sushi, and we did learn that uh, back in the day, I went to the same theater group that Akane is from. So hopefully Akane is going to give him some uh, helpful info about that. Kana was also insanely down bad last episode. Uh, hopefully something happens that turns her around. Maybe Aqua is going to have to do something, but I mean, I feel like Aqua likes her low key but she's just so in her head all right guys so before we get to today's reaction if you want to show me some support be sure to hit that like button if you have not done so yet smash that subscribe button hit the bell for notifications and a reminder i will be streaming these reactions over on twitch so if you want to get a head start on that go over there hit the follow button the link should be down in the description below all right guys so with all of that out of the way let's get it oh so it's official is it <laughs> what is going on oh my god she doesn't want to be it come on we we know she will on a dark chapter in my life it, she didn't sound that bad yeah, Loki Kana is an insanely hard worker. She deserves to be center. Whoa! Yo, why does she have such an attitude about this? Something, Something's going on in her head. <laughs> what is she upset about now? Yeah, but what's the reason? Why don't you want to? You, you'd think anyone would want to take that chance. Saying the opposite of how I feel. Please be peon. She thinks it's Aqua. And nope, <laughs> it's this dude. This guy's voice, man. <laughs> Uphill sprints? Alright, this is too much. <laughs> hey man, at least they're gonna be in shape. Kana is just always so down, man. I want something to happen that changes her, like, personality around. She just has so many, like, self-insecurities. See? There we go. Everything she says about herself is always her talking down about herself. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> I'm so happy. Finally, we're seeing her smile. Yeah, see, you got more. He's not your only fan. You probably have a lot that you don't realize. Yeah, look at her. Finally, she's she's smiling. I think I could fall for this guy. Yo, you got Aqua already. Relax. Dude, wait, I'm pausing it. I was thinking about this and that line just made me think. So I've been thinking this was Aqua the whole time under the mask because he doesn't look as buff as he usually does. I feel like this is Aqua and that's the reason why he's talking to Kana like this and saying he's a fan and all that stuff. If that's Aqua and he takes the thing off, I'm going to die. Given the water bottle again, just like he did last episode. I'm talking about Aqua. Dude, she she is not gonna let that kiss go off that show, huh? Always in my mind. She thought he was an angel when he was a kid. I wonder what Ruby's thinking about her saying all this. Look, Peon's watching her dance. This has got to be Aqua. He's FaceTime. So it is Aqua under the mask. Dude, I freaking knew it. 
Oh, it's the real one. He doesn't have the head on. Come on, show us his face. But yeah, this is the body build I was expecting. She'd rebel against it? I don't know, man. Your appeal drops by 30%. Damn, she's not even excited? She is just thinking like worst possible outcomes. Oh wow, they're bringing us back to this. Sheesh, I end up dying quietly. Her, her old life is so depressing, man. My first love. Is she talking about Aqua when he was the doctor? Yeah, she is. Damn, so he was the one that instilled the dream into her like that. That's wild. Come on, Connor, you got Aqua. I don't have anyone like that. Dude, her and Aqua need to sit down and have a talk. <laughs> Oh, she's gonna see him taking the mask. Yo, let's go. This is what I wanted. Yep, there it is. He's drinking a berserk. Yo, what is her reaction to, the, to this gonna be? I feel like this season is gonna end with their with their performance. She didn't sleep after seeing Aqua? Oh no, this is bad. Dude, her, her entire thought process, process is based around Aqua. Oh jeez. This looks terrible. <laughs> Yo wait, Mem's face. Damn, they, they're showing us a cake shot with her. Yeah, that's the first cake shot we've gotten with Waifu. This is not good. I feel like she's putting too much pressure on herself. Oh, God. She had to do a performance on a stage like that? Jeez, no. I would have stage fright if I was her. That's sad. She just has a stack of CDs, no one is wanting one. Dude, Kana's life, child life, is kind of, not kind of, it's very depressing in a way. Or at least the way, like, she portrays it. Yeah, she thinks she has no value. And she's still a child, like, that's messed up. Mm. So she thinks it's so it's so messed up the way she thinks if she's lead it'll tank the group. <laughs> the way she said what? Oh yeah, she's nervous. I feel like Aqua needs to have a talk with her before this concert. <laughs> Well, because of you two. Oh, she doesn't want to drag them down with her. But this is going to go exactly opposite of how she's thinking it's going to go, I feel like. Yeah, rookie idol. You're a rookie. <laughs> it's only natural to fail, yes. Ruby's spitting facts right now. I still want Aqua to show up, though. Hey, finally got a smile on the face. Let's go, boys. Make the fist. Let's go. Damn, look at her. Rookie idol. That's thumbnail. 100%. Damn, dude. I'm glad she had that turnaround at the end, but that was kind of a depressing episode from her point of view. All right, so that was episode 10, and I'm glad that we got an episode that was almost entirely focused from um, Kana's point of view. The entirety of last episode, she was talking bad about herself i really wanted to kind of like 
hear more of her inner thoughts and we got a lot of that in this episode it's just crazy how they're how much they're emphasizing how much like the entertainment and in, being in in whoa being in the entertainment industry as a child actor or just child in general can really mess up your mental thought process growing up like in her head after she got through fifth grade she feels like her life just ended because she's not a childhood actor anymore and she read too much about comments about her online and like she's not even finished high school she's like a, a like a second year right and she already feels like she she failed life or something but we did see and i i, I kind of called it that the peon that was training them was actually aqua in the suit i mean it, it was pretty obvious after a few scenes because he didn't look nearly as buff as he used to and he was wearing a track suit and i, I was like why is he why doesn't he just have his shirt off? i'm definitely interested to see if there's a conversation that happens between kana and aqua about her knowing that was him maybe that won't happen maybe she's not going to bring it up but i feel like they're they're heavily heavily foreshadowing that her and aqua are going to be a thing down the road so at least looking at high dive it says there's one more episode episode 11 i'm assuming that's going to be the last episode um for this season so i'm assuming it's just going to be like the concert all that's going to go down and then they're probably going to leave us on some heavy cliffhanger in regards to the father like aqua will find something out or something because we really haven't gotten a lot of the father plot line in this first season if i'm being honest like aqua's like the, the biggest piece of information he got was the last episode when he found out that she went to the same theater group so I, I'm assuming the next season or next core will will start to go more into that. I definitely would want to read the manga just to like find out more about it, but I'm not going to. But I definitely feel like next episode they're gonna put some heavy, heavy budget into the animation for for this uh, performance. All right, guys. So remember, if you enjoyed today's reaction, hit that like button. If you have not done so yet, smash that subscribe button. Hit the bell for notification. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Remember, stay blessed, not stressed out there. Hope to see you in the next one. Peace.